Good morning, everybody. You know what I was thinking? I could be wrong, but it's my opinion. Shit, I don't give a fuck. Just being me. Man, religion has taught us to deal with disrespect peacefully. You know, if someone's trying to harm you, leave it in God's hands and pray for them, etc. You know, shit like that. Man, forget all that. If someone is trying to hurt you, even if you're a believer of God and etc., you know, forget the praying. Praying for that person, not retaliating, you know, because back in the, uh, you know, those days, uh, they killed Jesus, you know. And he had the Last Supper, uh, then they killed him after. So, uh, you know, religion has taught us to uh, tolerate disrespect that's very harmful, that can kill you. Someone is trying to attack you peacefully. Like, pray for the person, leave it in God's hands and stuff like that. Sometimes you can't leave it in his hands, you know. It's just a lot with that. You know, different people have messed with the certain words and the scriptures and stuff like that. So we don't know if there is really a God or whoever, whoever your God is, you can follow him. You know, but we can't tolerate disrespect peacefully. It's like, you no, know, you know, pray for the person, you know, pray to God, whoever your God is, because we all have different gods. Uh, you know, pray for that person. It's like, okay, you can be good and pray and pray, but if someone is trying to harm you in any type of way, like physically, like you have to protect yourself. You know? So it's just, it's a lot that goes with that. Man, this ice cap, good as hell. Tim Horace ice cap. But, uh, yeah. It's just, it's a lot that goes with that. And I was just thinking about that, like, you know, like back in the day, the slaves were getting abused and, you know, we'll leave it in God's hands. Let's pray. You know, God is going to make this better and stuff. And they just kept disrespecting us. Just kept, they kept doing it, doing it, doing it, doing it. Even when we would uprise, we would uh, get killed. You know, some will get killed and some will run away and escape, you know. We've been going through it a long time, you know, so. Man. You can be a good person and pray and stuff, but if someone's trying to harm you just in a harmful way, that can take your life, throw that praying stuff out the window. You have to defend yourself. Because if you don't defend yourself, no one else will. And while that person that killed you, or whatever the case may be, still going to be alive, you're going to be, you know, somewhere in heaven, somewhere. You have to protect yourself. You know. Damn. That car almost hit that motherfucker. But anyway. just a lot, you know. So that's just what I was thinking. I'm like, man, we've been disrespect. We've been tolerating disrespect for the last couple centuries, you know, leave it in God's hands and pray and pray and pray, you know, that that person gets better. Don't harm that person if they're trying to harm you. Like, no, forget that. Uh-uh. No. No. No waste. No way, Jose. 
That's not happening. You know, if you're trying to harm me, trying to take my life away, I'm not praying for you. You know, I don't want you to pray for me. Okay? I believe in God, but <laughs> that stuff, hey, you know. A lot of people ain't going to take this video lightly or whatever. Hey, you know, I'm just speaking my thoughts. And that's this is my opinion. But we can't disagree as long as we, you know, be uh, respectful and not saying crazy comments, you know, talking about someone's race, etc. Keep the comments clean and don't be offensive, you know. And they, they're they going to uh, remove your comment anyway, you know. There was a few people that left some rude, offensive comments and not even see it because they wiped it off so quick. So, you know, you can't be negative no more. We can debate, people can debate stuff like that but once we start saying uh n words and you know saying uh you know different things about pride and you know calling someone a faggot or whatever you know stuff like that that you shouldn't be saying anyway if a person is gay or whatever the case may be you don't have to say that you know we all grown here ain't no little kids you know some of y'all be acting worse than little kids. Little kids know not to say certain things, you know. So you typing behind your keyboard saying negative stuff, it's gonna get uh it's gonna get erased anyway. YouTube is not playing no more of the, you know, offensive and you know, rude comments. So you'll just be running into a brick wall, you know, and find something to do. You know, because you people uh, that be on the internet sometimes just be saying anything you know y'all probably don't have no life at all you probably do have a life but you just you know you're just a negative person you just have to say something so negative and try to hurt somebody but words don't hurt you know the only thing that's gonna hurt is you because when you do stuff like that that makes you look bad and I don't know how y'all can look in the mirror and say that, you know, you're a human being. You're not. You're a piece of shit. You know? And you want to make everybody else feel down because you're down. You know? Crabs in a barrel. You know, you know when a crab try to get out, the other crabs bring the crab down. That's what you are. For those, for those people that does that. You know, but I'm glad I don't do that. You know, we can debate and stuff. I love debating and stuff like that. I reply back to your comments, like, comment, subscribe, turn your notification bell on. So every time I make a video, you'll be notified and we can chop it up. Just man, you know, it is what it is. Shit, I just love, you know, making videos and talking to the people, talking about all type of subjects. My channel is, is for everybody, you know. Even if you don't agree with what I'm saying, hey, we can debate, you know, stuff like that. You know, maybe your comment, I can learn something from it, and you can give me a different type of view, a different point of view, and we can still connect. And that's what it's about, you know. Even if a person doesn't agree with you, you have a debate, you see things from both sides, and you realize that, oh, okay, now I get what that person was saying, et cetera things like that the same thing with political issues you know if you voted for trump whatever the case may be you sit down and talk and you know it's like oh okay like you know let's come to a common ground you know all this bickering back and forth of who voted for who hey everyone have their right who they want to vote for once again like comment subscribe turn on your notification bells and we can chop it up Every time I make a video, you'll be notified. And uh, yeah, have a blessed day. Love y'all.